fellow Nigerians, do you know why people like Dangote, Tony Elomelo, or the obvious, the hotel dollars, and all the elites who own banks and uh, corporations in Nigeria will not support the idea of open Nigeria? The answer is simple. They don't want you to be free because open Nigeria will open doors to free, fair, equal, unlimited, and unconditional access to opportunities to every Nigerian. I didn't say some. To every Nigerian to grow and develop and progress and prosper according to his or her abilities and her level or his level of competency. When we have a society like that, then there will be an army of people who will guide and guard that society against being destro destroyed by a few of its citizens. This is the biggest problem we have in Nigeria. The inordinately rich keeps getting richer. Ask these men and women who own this Gangatuan corporations how they made their money and how they are still making their money. They are making their money from exploiting you through illegal bank charges. Every bank transaction you make, whether big or small, you pay a minimum of 52 naira or 60 naira. Check it out. If 100 million people own bank accounts in Nigeria, and then you do one transaction every week, as a result of which you pay $60 or 60 naira or 52 naira, as the case may be. <laughs> that is what they are doing. They are doing this because there is no government. The people in government like um, uh, MFL was one of them. He, he will let them do whatever they do, exploit you, steal from you with every minute transaction that you make. The work of a central bank is supposed to be that of regulating the commercial banks. So they have this old boy network with which they are destroying you, exploiting you, stealing from you, and stealing from our country. And this is the reason why we ask you to open your eyes, to see more clearly that all those donations, those scholarships they give, <laughs> they are what Oyibo man would call infinitesimal, that is immeasurable amount of what they steal from you on daily basis. And so you should not celebrate them. They are thieves. They are robbers. They are exploiters. Dangote, how did he make his money? He didn't make any money through any hard work. He didn't work harder than me. He doesn't work harder than any Nigerian. His money comes from insider trading with his elites gang up, those who gang up against Nigeria to hand over the country's economy to one man who hates competition. They will give him Nigeria's money to build refineries. They will give him Nigerian money to build com com uh, companies. And he says, it's his money. No, it's not his money. They all need to be rounded up and prosecuted. And I know definitely they'll be found wanting. So we can recover our money from them. Anything short of this is a joke. Any person coming to lead Nigeria must be one who is coming ready to die. Why trying to take everything that was stolen from Nigeria by these criminals, including the thief, Bola Metinubu, holding the entire country hostage and his terrorist vice 
<laughs> rogue president. Yes. Who has been confirmed connected to Boko Haram and terrorism in Nigeria. And all those, including the ex-governor of Zamfara State, who now is your country's rogue defense minister. A man, a man who was housing terrorists in the state government's house. A man who was buying terrorists and bandits operational vehicles. It's your defense minister. And you want Nigeria to be safe and secure. How dare you? If Nigerians must revolt, they must revolt with all these men and women in mind to take what they stole from their country from them. They don't own nothing but what they stole from Nigeria. They, are, they give them dollars to trade so that business will be easy for our people. What do they do? They give them to their boys on the street to sell. That's what they call round tripping. So if they give you $100 million and you turn around and sell it th three times uh, $100 million, they come back each with uh, how many million? $300 million each. Come on, people. Come on, people. Come on, people. Come on, people, Nigerians. Make on they open on our eyes. Now, now, these men and women that you look up to for what they don't have are the problems of Nigeria with uh, Tinubu and his gang of uh, criminals, including some who say they are traditional rulers and religious leaders. Yes, I'm telling you, those who say they are spiritual leaders, those who say that uh, Muslims cannot eat their ram during Salah unless they see the moon. How can a corrupt man be a religious and spiritual leader in a country? where people have sense something ain't right something i add up. but nigerians do you really want to save your country if yes yeah we are in it together so this is the reason why we call on you to join forces with open nigeria how do you join open nigeria two things you can do uh, one join us on facebook by first of all liking our page at open nigeria one that is o p e n n i G E R I A O N E. Go to Facebook and uh, follow Open Nigeria at Open Nigeria One. Then we have a national uh, WhatsApp platform uh, that we are. We have a lot of Nigerians in it. Come there, and if you have something to give in leadership, yes, join us. Then we can make things happen and assign you a role. But you must be a die-hard patriot of Nigeria. Who want the good of Nigeria, not the half measure patriot, not the one that is so unfortunate. Today you are here, tomorrow you are there, and next tomorrow you are somewhere else. We want those with character and strength of it to be the drivers of open Nigeria. Join us on YouTube at O N N. Okay, sorry, at Nigeria Now on O N N. At Nigeria Now on onn that is at nigeria now on onn if you want to listen to our revolutionary messages and share it in order to expand the ideology the reason we decided to create our special media is that nigeria has become babylon if you want to fight babylon you have to have your own media the corrupt mainstream media of nigeria will not air our messages because it's not what those who drive them want to hear all right they dish lies to the people of nigeria they mislead and confuse our people but we come with an alternative driven by the truth right and justice so to join us and subscribe to our channel you should do this subscribe to at nigeria now on onn at nigeria now on onn and that we have a global website and that is it is www.opennigerianow.com again it is www.opennigerianow.com 
our mumu don't do. We can save our country. We can unite our country against the dictates of our oppressors who hate to see us unite. They create phantom south and uh, a poverty stricken north. And then because they can't survive without this type of division, they will continue to sustain it with everything, including putting religion into it. How can a criminal, a hypocrite, be a religious leader that you are listening to as a Nigeria? Nigerians need an organic unity to make our Nigerianness real and not the fake that it is right now. God bless Nigeria.